Okay, so let me just warn you all right now. This is really fucked up. I'm just gonna say it now. Like, this is... I've been thinking about doing this for a few weeks. This video is a little overdue. But this fucking video is definitely one for the record books on my channel. Of probably some of the most fucked up shit I've ever seen in my life. So yeah, leave a like if you enjoy this fucked up stuff. And let's get into it. So last Christmas break, I was hanging out with a good friend of mine. Great friend of mine. Really good kid. And we were hanging out. Alright, he's a little bit younger than I am. And he has this friend of his. He's He invited him over. I've met him a few times prior to this event happening. But he's kind of immature. Just a little bit. And he talks about some fucked up shit in front of us. And he barely knew me when I first met him and he said some stuff that I never would have thought um, Anyone would say when they first meet someone, you know, just like really sexual ass shit like um, You know, he'll talk about him fucking jacking off or he'll talk about that He has tissues under his bed or some shit like that. It's like what the fuck dude But anyway, I was hanging out over at my friend's house during Christmas break and he was there and we were all just hanging out the three of us and I'm not gonna lie to you guys. All right. My friend's mom is pretty good looking she's a good looking lady now would i ever fucking say some really weird shit in front of her fuck no it's my homie's mom like i'm not gonna say anything and just because she was like my second mom at that point like you know what i mean i've known this lady for so long um but yeah she was good looking and you know my friends used to give him shit like, you know they'd come over and they'd be like bro your mom's a fucking milf bro i'd bang it in a second and he would always like fucking poke fun back like it wasn't ever a serious thing he knew they were joking and he'd joke back um, but this kid that we were hanging out with used to say some real creepy ass stuff. Like, he would actually be really weird and say stuff that we would actually think was true. Um, for example, during Christmas break, this is how it all basically started. Um, like I said, fucked up alert. We were sitting in the basement playing Halo 3 old school campaign. And we were just playing, you know, doing our fucking thing. And he's on the back couch on his iPod Touch, okay? And he goes, yo, Austin, come here. And I was like, okay, hold on a sec. So we pause the game and I go over to the couch that he's sitting on. And my friend's like, what, what's going on? And this kid is showing me photos on fucking Facebook of my friend's mom. Keep in mind, we are staying at his house. So if my friend was to walk over and see us, you know, looking at a fucking selfie of his mom, he probably would have thrown us out on the streets. So I was like, dude, fuck, like, what are you doing? And he's like, dude, isn't she hot? I was like, it's my fucking friend's mom. It's practically like my mom too, but fuck off. And I walked away because it's weird. And he just continued to go through her photos while he played Halo. And I was really about to just look over at my friend and be like, dude, yeah, that kid's back there on the couch looking at photos of your mom on Facebook, but I didn't because I knew that my friend probably would have punched him, so I didn't say anything. But anyway, I left the next day, and that kid stayed there, because, you know, they're such good friends, even though he's a creep. But I left the next day, okay, and I was at my house just for a few days during Christmas break, and he re-invited me back over um, to hang out with them again, and he was still there, like, he was practically spending the whole Christmas break at my friend's house, so I went over there. I greeted my friend at the door, I walked in, there was Mr. Creepy sitting on the couch on his iPod Touch, like always, and we went back to doing our Halo shit. Now this is when shit takes a turn for the fucked up side. So me and my friend were playing some Halo like we always do, and that kid's still on the couch on his iPod Touch, being creepy, and he goes, yo Austin, get over here. And I was like, alright dude, so I paused the game, I told my friend, I was like, yo, you could actually just play without me, like unpause it, I'll just be AFK, you do whatever. So he unpauses it and he's playing, I go over to the back couch, and he's on his iPod Touch, he fucking shows me his iPod, alright? He shows me what he's doing on it. And he pulls open these fucking Facebook messages with this kid's mom. He literally made a fake Facebook account. Okay, it immediately clicked, like, what he was doing. After I saw the messages, he made a fake Facebook account of, like, a middle-aged man that she knew previously, I guess, in high school or some shit. He's that creepy. He made a fake fucking Facebook account, flirted her up in PMs on Facebook, and got her to fucking send him photos. When I saw this shit, I was like, no, dude, what the fuck is wrong with you? That is actually creepy. And I, like, kind of backed away, and he's like, dude, no, 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 look, look, look. He's showing me all the fucking conversations. He's showing me pictures and shit. I was like, dude, stop. And I kind of, like, walked away. And my friend's like, wait, what's going on? And I tried to play it off as safe as possible. I was just like... Nothing, man. He's talking to some weird girl on Facebook. She's saying some weird shit. It's gross. He's like, oh, all right. So we went back to playing Halo, and I, at this point, my mind is, like, fucking scarred, dude. Like, he was literally... Like, let me put this in perspective for you guys. He was on his iPod Touch, flirting up the kid's mom whose house he was staying at. So he's flirting up this fucking mom while she's upstairs on her computer in the same house as us. So I just couldn't get that, like, through my mind. I was just sitting there baffled. And I just didn't know, like, the whole rest of the night, so awkward. I no joke just wanted to go home and, like, hit myself in the head with a fucking bat. It was so fucked up, it wasn't even funny. So, after the night ended, okay, I stayed the night there, the next morning I got picked up, and that kid left as well, and... 
that was so awkward. I remember going home and just being like, dude, that's the weirdest shit I've ever seen in my life. Um, but you're probably wondering, like, did he ever get caught? Like, did he, you know, are they still friends today? Well, the answer to that is no. Thank fuck they're not friends. Um, actually, a few months down the road, the kids said something really fucked up to him and they got into, like, a legit fight. Like, they were punching each other and now they hate each other, I think. Or they're just, like, mutual and they don't fucking talk anymore. But yeah, I thought you guys would enjoy this. It's straight out of the fucked up vault, um, yeah, if you like this, I mean, leave a like, and I'll talk about something else that's super fucked up, but yeah, guys, thank you for watching, I hope you enjoyed this really fucked up video, um, but yeah, guys, leave a like if you enjoyed, thanks for watching, I'll see you all tomorrow, peace.